One of the most common questions regarding machine learning is how important is it to know the math? To answer this, we will look at an example. Let's say we are building a robot and to build this, we need many hardware and software tools. We will focus on the hardware tools for this example. So to assemble the robot, we will need a very basic drill machine to fasten the bolts. Now, this task can be done with a screwdriver as well, but the drill machine helps speed up the process. So the question is, how much information do I need to actually use the drill machine? I would need to know the purpose of the tool, which is basically drilling and fastening bolts, how to use the tool, for example, inserting the drill bit, reversing the direction of rotation, etc. Some basic extra features and how to use them, like changing the speed and torque settings. And having the basic build knowledge wouldn't hurt as well. Things like it consists of motors, gears, some buttons, etc. But you do not need to know the details of the design, such as gear ratio, build material, motor RPM, and so on. So the software tools have the same purpose. Libraries such as TensorFlow, PyTorch, Scikit-Learn are all tools that help us in building and training AI models. So like the drill machine, we need to know how to use them and what are their features along with some basic understanding of the algorithms. The deep knowledge of math is not required to actually use these tools. But then who does all the math? If we look back at our example, the details of the drill machine build such as gear ratio, build material and motor RPM is required by the product designer and not the user. The same way in-depth knowledge of machine learning math is required by the researcher who creates them and works on enhancing these algorithms. So we can say that for every tool there is a manufacturer and a user. If you are on the manufacturing side, that is research of algorithms, then you need to know in-depth knowledge of mathematics. On the other hand, if you are just a user using the tools, then you do not need in-depth knowledge of mathematics just the overall concept and how to use the features provided. If you think about how many people are actually designing drill machines versus how many actually use them, you can get the rough idea of how many people in machine learning are actually working on research versus how many are actually using the tools. So in summary, you do not need in-depth knowledge of mathematics to get started with machine learning if you are just using it as a tool. All the basic maths you need is straightforward and is easy enough for anyone to understand. On the other hand, if you are going to enhance or develop new AI techniques, then you need all the maths you can get. In the upcoming video, we will use machine learning tools and see how we can create different models to solve real world problems. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one.